Dr. Lyman Beecher Todd, buried in Lexington Cemetery in Lexington, Kentucky, in the Todd family plots. The Todd family plots hold the remains of the in-laws of Abraham Lincoln. Dr. Todd holds a special place in history that you have probably never heard of. It always amazes me how being in the right place at the right time or wrong place at the wrong time can put you right square in the middle of history. Todd family plot in Lexington Cemetery in Lexington, Kentucky holds the final remains of the in-laws of President Abraham Lincoln. Mary Todd Lincoln, wife of Abraham Lincoln, was born in Lexington to a wealthy family. Today, several members of that family rest here in Lexington Cemetery. However, there is one member of her family that we are visiting today. Dr. Lyman Beecher Todd was a cousin to Mary Todd Lincoln. The Todd family was very large and affluent for their day, with wealth that most residents of Kentucky could never dream. Dr. Todd was said to be an admirer of President Lincoln and he considered his cousin, Mary Todd, a dear friend. Dr. Todd cared for many residents and all patients over 90 years of age he called upon weekly and even sent them flowers. At one time in Lexington, there were as many as 15 people over 90 that he made a part of this exclusive group and as such, he was very proud of it. He was a very well-respected doctor and citizen as evidenced by his epitaph which reads, in loving memory of a life that was a constant inspiration to truth and honor. It wasn't his stature in the community or as a well-thought-of doctor that provided him with historical significance. It was a fateful trip on April 14, 1865, to a theater that provided Dr. Todd with a brush with history, Ford's Theater in Washington, D.C. I love visiting the graves of those who have historical significance. Dr. Todd is probably not a name that you will read in the history books, but believe me, when I tell you where he was on one particular night, you will see that he definitely has a place in history. The United States was gripped with political and civil unrest at the time President Lincoln visited Ford's Theater for a production of the play Our American Cousin. There was an elaborate plan to take the life of President Lincoln which included a multi-faceted plan to end the lives of the top cabinet members of the administration. Although the rest of the plan didn't shape up to what was intended, Unfortunately, this part of the plan did. John Wilkes Booth, an actor in Maryland, carried out the horrific and unthinkable plan to end the life of President Lincoln. Lincoln was watching the play from a private box seat. He and his party arrived late to the theater, but when he did, the orchestra stopped the play and performed Hell to the Chief, which produced applause from the audience. After Booth carried out the horrific action, he jumped from the balcony and fled. Most of us who have had U.S. history are familiar with this, however, it's what you won't find in the history books that we are looking at today. Also in attendance was Dr. Lyman Beecher Todd, Mary Todd Lincoln's dear cousin. He would accompany the president as he was taken across the road to the Peterson House in Washington, D.C. There were several physicians called to the side of the president. It is unclear whether or not Dr. Todd participated in the treatment, although it is presumed that he did. When the autopsy of President Lincoln was performed, Dr. Todd was also in attendance. Dr. Todd simply thought that he was going to watch a play, unknowing that he would be a first-hand witness to one of the most tragic and historic events in U.S. history. Dr. Lyman Beecher Todd passed away on May 13, 1902, in Lexington, Kentucky. Dr. Todd will be remembered as a beloved citizen and doctor who happened to find himself a part of history. And you know, these are the types of stories that I love to tell, things that you probably didn't know about, and I learned new things, things that I didn't know about. So thank you so much for taking this look at the life of Dr. Lyman Beecher Todd, just a very historic figure in Lexington Cemetery who happened to find himself a part of history. 
I do ask you all, if you enjoyed the video, please give me a thumbs up and please comment what you think. Let me know if you've ever heard of him. Uh, I had actually, I've seen this stone in here before, but I had never really heard of the story behind him. So I'm glad to be able to tell that today. So please like and give me a comment. Also, please subscribe if you haven't. That really helps us out. Please subscribe. Find me on Facebook and on Instagram by searching for WitDocs. I do have, I'm going to do a video about the Todd family plot, and I've got several more coming on the way that I do believe that you will enjoy. Once again, I do want to thank you all for watching. Thank you for the support. Thank you for coming along with me on my journeys. I will see you again soon.